Hail deputies. So I turned in uh, the mission with Reese. He gave me some gaps and some attitude. And then uh, Dance has a mission for me. I'm ready. You ignore Outstanding. Over the years, the Brotherhood has sent several recon teams to the Commonwealth. The last squad went in three years ago. They never reported back. Officially, they're missing, presumed dead. You want me to find out what happened to them? Correct. We owe them that much. Their insertion point was in the hills near Malden. Survey the area and establish a search pattern. Monitor your radio for distress signals. All recon teams are issued distress pulsers that put out a short-range homing beacon. If you can acquire a signal, you should be able to trace it to its source. Okay. Didn't think you'd show your face again. Ready to clear out another area? I'm ready. Roger that. I'll mark the location on your map. See you when the target's clear. Clear out super duper mart. Okay, I'll put it on my list of things to do. Here, I think that's Lexington. I think that would probably be easier to do than going way over some. Um, I don't know where is it, Malden or whatever, to look for this team. Of course, I still need to get to Diamond City. So, hmm. Super Duper Mart. Diamond City. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Well... <sighs> I think I'm gonna go to Diamond City. I've done enough Brotherhood stuff for a little bit. I think it is time to um, time to to get to Diamond City is what I think. We're just going to go cautiously because you never know where zombies lurk. Fraternal foes, one fifteen. This bridge, right? Mm. 
is this big building? CIT Rotunda. You don't believe in lunch? crash into the bridge what's going on yeah Let's see, it is 6 p.m. The day went by really fast. At least it feels that way. Diamond City, here I come. Head to where I don't know from. We're gonna get there, we are indeed. We're gonna probably shoot something. Buy me what a little rain, wind, and weed will do to a place. Yeah. Diamond City, straight ahead. Mutant Town.
looks like maybe they were mutants living here and then the zombies came and got them. Maybe. You scared me, Godsworth. Godsworth, get out of my way! to see that the Diamond City Leafs have things under control. Hmm. See anything of value, Godsworth? Oh, well, he scary. certainly doesn't need that anymore. He certainly doesn't. Seriously, the security got killed? Get, get out of the way of Cosworth. Because they seem to be pretty hale and hearty a minute ago. It's not looking good. For Diamond City. Or for us. God's words. Holy macaroni. Holy macaroni. Go to hide. It's like, oh my god. Taking pop shots at us, eh? Charlie's. Tis but a scratch. Did you evade them, Cosworth? <coughs> we gotta figure a way to get into Donna City.
What was that? <coughs> I don't know. It was zombies, Codsworth. Standing out in the open here, crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, survivor. Sorry, just doing my job. Try to loot some bodies. Well, hello there. Hmm. Good job, Godsworth. Side. I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that Ooh, printer scrapped for parts. Mr. Pirate mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. Well...
a little preoccupied at the moment. Speak up, I couldn't hear you. Oh, I have a lot of, uh, move cover. Yeah, uh, I'll talk to you now that I've finished what I was doing, but... Alright, whatever. <laughs> um, get out of the way, Mr. Mayor. First newspaper ever published in Boston. So, this is the famous Diamond City. I suppose I hope to find more of a gem than a dusty home base. Civilization in the rough, if you will. Mm hmm. We'll talk more once I get settled in. Oh, yeah, right. Because you're oh so important. Why don't they pick up the trash? Piper, you're back. Hey, kiddo. How are the paper sales? Well, the presses are getting overloaded. That motor is going to go soon if we don't replace it. Uh, you've been saying that for weeks and the old girl still keeps cranking. Stop worrying so much. Now I gotta head into the office. You start whistling if you see any angry politicians coming our way. Why? Is something wrong? Piper? <sighs> you guys need to be more worried about the zombies than the politicians. So this is your, uh, your office? Where, where are you anyways? Hmm. I could have swore she went in here. Oh, there you are. I'm glad you dropped by. You holding up, Blue? Um, it's been a bad day. Not like a cozy day in the vault, huh? Yeah, I know where you're from. Jumpsuit's a dead giveaway. So here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what. I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. Well, you're really going to watch my back against all those zombies, but see, I'm not a vault dweller. Good. Let's get down to business. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Um, I've been having too much fun blowing things up to think about it. Gotta make my job hard for me, huh? All right, if that's the quote, that's the quote. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? Hmm. Find who's responsible and make them pay. I'll take anger over apathy any day. Good quote. Thanks, Blue. That's everything. It's going to take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to get Diamond City plenty to talk about. 
Look, I didn't know if you were on the up and up before, didn't want to waste my friend's time, but I think he can help you. His name's Nick Valentine, a detective extraordinaire. Got an office here in Diamond City. Just look for the neon sign with the heart in it. Uh, I don't see how he could possibly help me. <laughs> That's what most people say. Until they need him. And don't look now, Blue. But you do. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. Uh. Head well. my way. Let's go. Will do. Okay. Bobby pins, a girl after my own heart. This they passed 199. Trip down memory lane with that. Turn back. This and that and the other thing. Maybe constantly trying to kill us, but the Commonwealth never lacks for excitement. The synthetic tree. Yeah. I don't want to read her stupid magazine. Like taking candy from a baby. Okay. No cut. Oh. washer even work in the apocalypse <coughs> big loud full of corrupt officials and brown nosing citizens but it's home I can sleep in here because it's nighttime. Well, I cannot sleep in there. Let's check upstairs. And no, I can't sleep there either. Don't move, Simp. What have you done with the real Riley? Where's my brother? I swear, I'm not a Simp. Don't shoot, for God's sakes. We're family! Put the gun down, now! He's a Simp! He'll kill us all! Kyle, no! Okay, show's over. There are no Simps. I need you, you to step off. away, Scabber. My own brother. I understand, officer. I just want to know what happened. You got bricks for ears? I said get the hell out of here now. All right. <coughs> well, I think I'm just gonna sit here till morning. And rest. So I can do some buying and selling. What's everyone still standing around for? Hope Go you've enjoyed this. Please business. give me a thumbs up. Comment below. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so you don't miss a single episode. We'll see you later.